Perp, overall, was it a deserved win? I think so. Yeah, I think so. I mean, just for the statistics, for the way we played, I'm really pleased. I think so. And did you see the goal coming, uh, especially so late? Uh, yeah. Apparently it was a, a replay, but uh, yeah, the performance. Uh, to be honest, it's quite similar to what you've done many years, many years here. But all the time was Song or Kane for the the quality with the nothing they they score. But uh, yeah, today we perform incredibly well. What pleased you most? Everything, from the minute one until 95. Well, you you were very animated with the players uh, at the final whistle there. Uh, what was the message you're putting across to them? No, no, congratulate them. Mm -hmm. So we are. We defend the title and coming here, the draw was a little bit difficult and, and uh, we respond perfectly. C can you understand Tottenham being aggrieved with the nature of the goal? I think they obviously felt it might have been disallowed for a foul. I don't know because I didn't see the action. So, But the consistency in actions and the other actions, so I don't know. So I didn't see the actions, honestly. Nathan Aki has a uh, good habit of winning, coming up with winners in these games. Last year against Arsenal, the big games, and, and today, tonight as well, obviously the winner. Yeah, he has an incredible tempo. He has an incredible, incredible tempo, and, and our set pieces in attack is our, one of the best headers. And how important is it as well just to have avoided the replay? Uh, yeah, but you have to replay. We've got to replay with our fans, so. But from here against that team, like they create a lot, a lot in every game for the way they play and the courage we do with the ball, without the ball. So I'm, I'm really pleased. Can I ask you about Jurgen Klopp, who's decided he'll be leaving Liverpool at the end of the season? Are you surprised to hear that? Yeah, a little bit, a little bit, <coughs> a little bit. So he's an absolutely an incredible manager, and I think I don't know him closely but I think he's an incredible person as well so I had the feeling that uh, when the NSC is leaving part of us and Man City is leaving too uh, have been our biggest rival uh, Liverpool in these years uh, personally in Dortmund and he have been my biggest rival so I think we'll be missed uh, personally I will miss him uh, I'm a little bit pleased because without him I will sleep a little bit better <laughs> the nights before we play against Liverpool, uh, but uh, but uh, I wish him all the best. And he doesn't admit it, but uh, he will be back. When he says he's running out of energy, his energy levels are low. Can you relate to that? All the managers, yeah. When you are in, in many years, many many years in the same place, <laughs> I understand completely. I felt that in Barcelona, so. All the arguments I hear today, I listen about that, I, I understand completely. And what do you think will be the impact on Liverpool's team? They're doing so well this season. Yeah, like <laughs> every season, yeah. you know, when they had all the squad and no injuries, always they compete for everything. It's not a surprise. So the level of consistency in being there had been and will be. We know that. Thank you very much. You're welcome.